what more can I say? She needs counseling. He needs counseling. He's lost a lot of endorsements. And she's probably going to start losing endorsements as well because it really sends a bad message to women who have suffered from domestic violence. And so it's like a storybook, but it's no storybook. This is real life. My message to you guys who are young, young or old, especially you young kids out there, it's not safe to go back to somebody who has abused you. I went through it. And look at the pictures. I hope you can learn from these bruises, beatings. It will go over and over and over again. Until one day when you decide to revenge. And then you'll be the criminal. In her song, she says she doesn't want to be a murderer. And, I mean, just listen to the words. It's amazing. I don't want to be a murderer. Back in my 20s, there was a movie called The Burning Bed. I think it aired about 1984, 85. Well, the actress' name was Farrah Fawcett, and she acted as the woman who was abused domestically. It was really bad. The guy really abused her. It was a husband and wife movie, and one day she snapped. She got some gasoline and poured it on him while he was sleeping in the bed and set it on fire. Pretty much the house caught fire, and he died along with the house. And that's why the movie was called The Burning Bed. Technically, Farrah Fawcett became a murderer. This is just another example of what can happen to Rihanna. And she's already said she doesn't want to be a murderer, so I suggest she leaves now. I don't want to be a murderer. On the other hand, I would like to advise Rihanna to really think about dating Chris Brown again. It's not good for her image now. It's not good for his image, of course. He has not healed, and he has not been healed from counseling. It's way too soon. So, I really wish them some really good luck. I hope she doesn't get even more injured from this. Boy, I'm shocked. Anyhow, enjoy the music. Why do I feel like this? Bum, bum. 